I never thought that I would be defending Norman Mailer, but this news just came in. Random House is not publishing a new Norman Mailer collection of his political writings, because one junior staffer at Random House decided that he or she was offended by the white Negro. For those who don't know Mailer, this is his most famous essay. It's also his most infamous essay. It's deeply problematic. But the idea that an entire publishing house can bend to the will of one junior staffer? Why can't we let the public decide? I mean, this essay had a huge impact, and it's worth interrogating why it did. It's worth interrogating why an essay this vile made waves. At what point do we stop cancellation? There are a lot of classic texts I don't like, but I wouldn't stop them from being published. And Mailer was a misogynist, he stabbed his wife. Not a pleasant guy. But when we start erasing cultural influence, how do we have a conversation to prevent noxious elements from happening again?